morning everyone. Hi Milan. Mommy. So what are we gonna do today Milan? Ha. Today exam? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah. So, so pen, pen. Ah. Chocolate and pen. Ah, ah. So, for good luck for their exam, something like that. Like, mm -hmm. best of luck for your exam. Mm -hmm. 10 and 12th board exam. Mm -hmm. It's like a board exam. Mm -hmm. It's national level and state level exam. Mm -hmm. It's not the system in Philippines. You don't have 10th grade and 12th grade. We have right now. And right, we are the la uh -uh. But is it national level? Or mm. state level? We also have national achievement test. Let's see if I will be there. So now we are currently buying a pen and chocolate mm. for Jainik. Mm. Because he is currently in bar, no, mommy? Yes, bar, 12th. 12th grade. So the exam will be coming. And why are we going to her his hostel to wish him luck? Yes, we him mm. This is the last time we can meet him in hostel. Mm, it's like a meeting, no? So usually, the kids here are like in hostel, no? Usually they are living in hostel, so they rarely see their family. So this is the last time before their exam starts that they will see their family. So we are currently here in this store, and this is where we're gonna buy. Oh, this is a a school stop store. They can bring this pad. In board exam, mm -hmm. only transparent pad is allowed. Mm -hmm. Material her quit, yeah. Ah, material her quit. The color pad mm -hmm. is not allowed because of cheating issue. Mm -hmm. Only transparency is allowed. And where's the pen? So, so they specifically have like this, like in every store there is like this, no? Because of the 10th and 12th grade. Transparent. You have to bless that so he will pass. <laughs> Guys, I'm trying this ball pen. No? I'm trying this ball pen and look what it found, what it tried. <laughs> no? It's very good ball pen, no? It's very good ball pen, really. But no. you can... And then this is the ball pen that we're gonna give. Ah, must touch it. Good quality. Narod. Guys, nilalatag talaga nila lahat ng mga bili yung mga ball pen, no? So we can choose properly. Siguro kung sa Pilipinas to, mabib mabubisit na. Pero siya talaga, oh. Pinapakita niya talaga lahat sa mga customers niya. Ganito talagi sa India. This is how they sell in here. They will give you every choices they can get. Patel Varanski, Ratwa Suba, Patel Gavanji, Kohil Yuraski, Ready so Joynik, <laughs> Mami, Keuche, Mama, Joynik, Milan, <laughs> Aksu, hi. <laughs> Guys, there is actually food over here, all where you can eat. And everyone is eating. Look guys, so many people eating. 
Ayak so. Milan ba ya? He's busy eating. Ah, kau kau. Ah, masuk je. So currently we are sitting in here. Aksu, everyone is sitting, and we're visiting Jainik. He will be having his exam this coming. Kya kya re exam? Atias. Atias this coming March. So we are here spending time. Ek divas ek may na he ne mami. Ek divas ek may na. Ah, hindi. People here used to, you know, used to live in hostel. Like the students here, they are always away from their family studying. Bar, bar standard. Jainik. Bar. Ah, bar standard. Ah, ah, school. Sat standard to bar standard. Punch. Punch standard. Punch. Oh, ima. Punch. Punch standard. Pat. Si ba. To bar. Oh. See guys, from 5th standard to 12th standard, they are already living in the hostel away from their family. Bara bar chef, hostel. Master chef. So, they prepare here leaving their kids at hostel. B.A.P. Swaminarayan. B.A.P. Swaminarayan. Hi everyone! So, we are just back and we are currently on our PJs. Because we visited the brother of Milan Baya, the cousin of Milan Baya, and he will be taking the 12th standard exam. Milan, when was the when is the standard exam? 12th standard exam and 10th standard exam is the main exam in here. You give 10th standard first, and then if you did good, you have to choose stream that they will prefer you according to your percentage or according to your interest, science, mm -mm. commerce, and arts. So if you choose science, you will be studying physics, chemistry, biology, mm -mm. and mathematics. If you choose commerce, you will be studying accountant subject. Like ah, this it one. seems like in yes, And then arts is like art subject, economics and all that kind of subject, art subject. Same like in the Philippines. Mm. And then you according to whatever stand. subject you choose, you give 12th grade, which is also the national board exam or state board exam. We but also that's have... too very 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 important exam to decide your future here in india why because that's the thing which will university will give you admission on it's very hard the to better get the grades yes in very hard i had 89 percentage in right. biology physics and chemistry combined right. out of 100 oh. and still he did not manage. i still didn't get because of me well, because i'm general talk. category that's different topic we're gonna talk about that in next time. Yes, yes. But in the Philippines also, we have that national achievement test, right? Mm -hmm. Right, guys? If you guys are from Philippines and you studied in like the Philippines... Like NMED? Like something like the national achievement test and while we're in its national, they will put the... Like, they will check the rank of your school and... Basta! It's very, very broad topic. And then, there's also 10th grade and then they recently they implemented that 11 and 12 they added two years uh, um, before it was school. from 10 right? 10. Ah, 10. when i was studying it was just until 10 mm -hmm. for uh, grade uh grade first year second year third year fourth year mm -hmm. did you get how was the ano how was the experience of hostel diba, Jay, Nick, i was surprised because jay nick was living in the hostel like they they rarely see jay nick because yes. They they are just seeing one day for one month, not even one day, like very few four times hours, a only four hours. Me, I usually start studying in hostel from grade three. Third grade. Yes, third grade means how how old I would be? Like eight, five, around eight. eight, around eight year old. Mm -hmm. When I was eight year old only, mm -hmm. I started living in started living in hostel. When I was eight year old only. And then until 8th, until 7th grade, I studied in one hostel. After 7th grade, 8, 9, 10, 11, I went to very far, mm -hmm. 500 kilometers far from my home to study in hostel. Mm -hmm. And then another hostel and then direct Philippines after 12th grade. How was the experience? Good. It's just hostel. You just only boys hostel though. Mm -hmm. No girls allowed. You what? cannot even see girls. No <laughs> girls. Like total boundary. And there is no girl around. You would be never single. 
this is the first actually this one is the first one i flirted properly what flirt oh that's the... don't use the word flirted you talk to properly no i flirt with you properly you know guys when me and milan started talking he doesn't even know how to court someone he doesn't even know how to flirt with why someone. you're why? just just admit it because he... i was never exposed to this culture he's just like a kid to me guys because ah uh, well probably we're gonna give him the ano uh, the benefit of the doubt because i don't know if i'm saying the right words but you're you're still a kid when i met you Maybe. because you don't have any experience so that's an excuse it's fine i understand <laughs> but that makes him pure guys because he's just like a kid he's very sweet to me actually i'm missing that kind of thing <laughs> i'm actually missing that type like that that, that that kind of milan yes mm -hmm. very sweet but now nothing uh, not even not anymore is there bullying also in india yes mm. that's very big issue begging especially in medical school mm. very big i went to the i when i was in 11 and 12 mm -mm. we was all scared of like ah this is not even starting of ragging this is not even bullying mm -hmm. when you go to medical school it's just like so much extreme so much stress and the senior will no in india yes the senior will only bully you for first year it, it just there is anti ragging squad in every single college mm -hmm. but anti ragging squad is just like just like letter h in honest mm -hmm. it doesn't work because in the and philippines then, and then i went to philippines mm -hmm. and there is no rigging in philippines there i is. don't know how but in where i studied there was no rigging yes yes there is no how it's possible because in, in philippines in philippines in high school well it's just a petty fights but still called bullying right mm -hmm. so in my school i think there were some little bit of bullying but not graver in they will like punch you and everything just emotional bullying and no in here some bullying are very extreme mm -hmm. you should you should guy you guys should watch the movie mm -hmm. table number 21 mm -hmm. you didn't watch it yet not yet table number 21 wait wait, wait. i'm about, gonna make disclaimer about, first i'm not bullying. saying that emotional bullying and physical that i'm not saying that emo, physical bullying is much more worse than uh, emotional bullying guys ha i did not say anything like that but in the philippines is not that i don't know in my school in the philippines is not that much extreme mm, and maybe i just don't see it because i'm just the normal girl i don't really get bullied and all actually i'm i'm the student leader type yes go i was the vice president of our ssg club student supreme student government and i was i'm always the host hi guys good morning everyone to all faculty guests that and... kind of guy get bullied the most in india <laughs> so if i'm in india i will get bullied you know guys you've seen the the guys wearing white one he used to do that yes mm -hmm. i used i used to be very 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 firm on my religious belief and all i was mm -hmm. doing everything to please the god no, i don't know what happened to me but you still love god that's it guys so and bullying is very extreme in india you should guy you mm -hmm. guys should be happy that you are in philippines and philippines college there is no bullying there is milan it's nothing compared to what in india is well you <laughs> you experience both so i'm not gonna argue with that but there is bullying in philippines there is you're you just, just not aware about of bullying it. in indian college mm -hmm. especially medical and college. also when someone is taking an exam 10th grade and 12th grade we guys are giving sweets and pen no as good luck mm. so we gave jenik some pen and some chocolates mm. to eat only yeah. boys hostel mm -mm. we don't have girls boy hostel together mm -mm. so that's it guys i hope you learned something from us bye bye